Hello, welcome back again. My name is Ashley. Today we're gonna do Armenian needle lace and we're gonna make a queen crown design today. So we're gonna start. All right. All right. Now this design, I don't have it again, but I'm gonna show you over here. It's very beautiful design it is. Now I just did regular seed, which is just like the way you do your needle lace because I don't wanna go round and round. I wanna show you here so I can finish it fast and I can show you because it's going to be few layer. So this is now we started. The first two ones I'm just going to leave it just to be like starter. Now on your needle lace of course like this you have to count each seed so everything it comes the same place just like the way over here you see it. Big seeds and then one, two, three, four, five small seeds and then goes one more big seeds. Five little seeds, one big seed. Those big seeds, when you jump, it becomes bigger seed. So now, the first two, I'm not going to count. So we're going to start from here. Okay. Now on your needle lace, you have to count each of them. So it will be perfectly even. So this is one. I'm not going to count the first two. I'm going to start from here. So it looks neat and clean for you. This is two. And this is three. And then we're going to jump, we're going to jump one, we're not going to take next, we're going to jump to the second. And I think I did another design with white, which I show you later on. I forgot to give the name. They have names, sometimes I'm forgetting the names to tell you the truth. There's one, this is two, and this is three. Now, whoever is starting new, always it's good to put black uh, uh, material on top of your knee so you can see every detail. While I'm putting it here for you to see it. Once you get used to it, you do not need it, maybe. Once you get better. And whoever never done this, you can go on a playlist on my videos and you can see the playlist and you can click on. It shows all my needle laces separate part it shows the cooking and art and crafts and everything so now we did three seats and then we jump one we did one two three seats and we jump the fourth seat to the next one two three now we're gonna jump this we're gonna come here the needle goes uh, in the hole the top the front part it stays always on top the back part goes under if you watch this video, you will learn very easy. I'm repeating so many times the same thing. So I'm sure you will know by heart by now. You will know by heart by now, yes. Two and three. All right, now we did this. Let's say we went round, we finished it, and we came back to the front, okay? Let's do this. This the first two I'm not going to count. All right. Now, usually we will see later on what's going to happen over here. So I'm going to do the same seeds. And then we're going to jump in the middle over here. Just like so. All right, you can see, I hope. There you go. And now we're going to make three little pedals over here. There is one. There is two. Now, if you want, you can do just two pedals. If no, you can do three pedals. Three pedals, it always will look pretty. More pedals, it's better. So now we did two, three pedals here. Like you see, three seeds, and then we jumped on the big bridge. We did three pedals, flowers, and now we go back to the regular seeds. There you go. Now we're going to make one 
and two and now we're going to jump to the big one There you go. Now we're going to do three seats here. There's always you can pull it, push it with your nails. That's one. My hands, my fingers, they look very bad because it's always in the water, in the garden, always working. Forgive me. And I cannot put cream while I'm doing my needle lace because they get dirty very fast. There's three pedals. Now we're going to jump to the seed. Make sure always when you do your needle lace, wash your hands. That's one. And now this is two. Now we're going to jump here again. Those are the handkerchief threads. All right. There's one seed. Now we're going to make three little pedals. That's one, that's two. If I'm going too fast for you guys, you can watch the other shows and you see what we're doing if you never done it. This is three and now we go to the seeds. That's one and this is two. Now I'm gonna cut again. We'll pretend that we went around because it's going to take time. That's why I just have to do short ones so you can see. And now we go back again. This is just to start. You don't have to do it. If you want to do it on handkerchief, you can do the same thing and go. Actually, sometimes I do on my dresses, like, you know, when I wear it as a color, I do those kind of things. It looks very beautiful. So, all right, this is, of course, the beginning, the first that we didn't have to count, which is regular seed. There you go. Now, from here, we're not going to go here. We're going to jump to the seeds, to, uh, to the pedal. All right, so we go to the pedal. There is one pedal this is the second pedal and this is the third pedal and then we don't jump we don't go next to it but we jump to the seeds don't make it too big there you go now this is next to it it's a seed now the third one over here, we don't do this, but we jump to the pedal. And now we go to the pedals again. Don't make it too big on the pedals. And this is... The third, we don't go here, we will go next to it. Just make sure that they will be even both sides, so they will look very nice. The important thing is to make the seeds everything even. When you make it even, it looks good. When you make one big, one small, it starts to get messy. So, now we go to the second, and now we go to the third. Now, we don't go to the under, but we jump to here. And then this is the last, unless, unless you're continuing. So now if you notice here, you will see how it's becoming in the middle, like a little mountain. Let me put this on the floor, on a table, and let me bring this, let's see. Let's bring the material high up so you can see. Do you see it? How is the pedals comes and over here in the middle, it's becoming like an Ararat mountain, small. You see it? So that's how it's the design it's gonna show. And now we're gonna cut again. We'll go back again. All right. 
Of course, these first two were not counting because I just wanted to start. So, it's already my mountain is done. So now, from here, we're going to jump to the seeds. To the bridge, I should say. And we're going to make very little seeds. Like one. Two, we're going to make five seeds over here. After your jump, one, two, three. The third one, you'll make it a little bit like a pedal. All right. And then you add two more little ones. That's one. And two. Now you can go and jump to the next. Make it small pedals so they will look beautiful. Don't make it too, too big, but you don't have to make it too, too small. Something that doesn't become wavy or too much tight. Now you jump here and you make one, two, and then little pedal, like small one. You don't have to be too big. Just a little bit to be noticeable that it's a design. And then two little seeds next to it. There you go. And now you come over here. Now over here, you can just do regular seed and jump or what you can do you can put a little bigger seeds over here a, a little bigger pedal i'm sorry just like a flower on top of the mountains and then you jump next to it to make the your design beautiful so we'll make this we join first and then we'll make two little seeds that's one Two, now we make a little pedal, very short one, just like a little seeds. And then we'll make it two little babies, baby seeds. There you go. Now we're gonna make another seeds over here. Small ones, not too big, not too small, just like a size of a as much as it needs space. When you make it too big, it will be wavy. Don't make it too tight so it doesn't um, scrunch. That's two. Now we're going to jump next. My thread is finishing. All right. Now we're going to do pedals again. That's one. That's two. I hope you can see it. I'm going to show you. And then a little baby pedal. Just to be obvious that it's a little pedal standing. Oh. And then we'll do two more. I have to untangle my thread. That's one. That's two. And now you go to the little one, to the top of the mountain. Now you make a pedal over here, just like we did over here. You see it. All right, I think my thread is all gone, but I'll make this pedal. But I wanna show you, this is the design that you have to do. All right, well, 
here that you see this is the design it's gonna do for you now this design what you can do is always just like a finishing of the needle lace let's say you finish this do you see over here it's a different design is done on top so this can be the finishing too finishing design it's very very beautiful you just have to take your time so it will make it everything nice and even those things we don't count of course when i did it i just wanted you to show and i didn't want to go round and round because it was going to take too much time let me put this under the black again so you can see what the design is here it is so when we continue we came here it would have been, it would have done exactly this design this is a queen crown it is that's all i call like you know each of them if you hold it they look like a crown sitting on a queen head and i want to show you yesterday what i was showing you another time i showed you one this design this design it's a grapevine when you see when you go to winery you see all the grapes this is a grapevine and i don't know what else i did I'm, i don't remember i'm not sure if there is a name and this is another one you can always put at the end or even in the middle you can do because you can always go on top of them and do another design so this is the crown the queen the king crown and this is a grapevine all right one more thing i want to show you now that how you can put your thread not to touch it all the time and when you have your thread you don't want to handle it all the time because sometimes our hands is oily or whatever but like i always say always wash your hands especially when you are working with the small uh, dmc threads like this because they are clean and white it might get oily and then when you're doing your needle lace it might get patches in the while the time goes by so this is just a practicing thread it is what i wanted to show you that all kind of thread that you are working as a needle lace let somebody put their finger hands like this just all around the chair and go around and around and see how long when you are new beginner especially it's good to cut it after you do it round and round your thread which i like you understood me going round like this and going again like so many time until you get enough and what you do later on you cut it only one side and then you put on your neck like this which i have over here i always do that instead always to handle my thread and make it dirty i keep this in a safe place and while i hang it like this i just pull it from the bottom one of the thread it comes out well usually i pull it from here not from the bottom i will just hold it and pull it like this and i use it just like the way it is so this way i will always keep it on my neck so i don't have to handle my thread of course this is much longer than the chair because i can work with even longer than this but we don't want to have too too long when you're starting because when you do it too long then it might get nuts and it will be hard for you to every time to play with it to untangle the nuts so try to make it a little bit shorter beginning until your hands get used to it so this is the, that's what i want to show you all the time but i'm always busy i forget about it so this is the way you keep it on your neck and you pull it one by one the thread all right well thank you for watching i hope you like this if anything you need question you can ask i have plenty designs on my channel on videos if you go and you see i don't know how many needle laces designs for you and if you're just starting beginning 
go from the one to eight and practice and practice and practice and then you will do very good well thank you very much again for watching and if you're watching first time please subscribe my channel if you like and like and i thank you again bye bye thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed this channel i want to thank to all my patrons on patriot.com for their support to make my channel possible thank you